Israel's new national security minister Itamar ben Gvir visited the Temple Mount on Tuesday morning in a surprise visit. He made the trip one day after he publicly announced delayed plans to do so following a meeting with Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu Monday evening. He arrived with heavy security coordinated in advance with the police and kept secret. Upon arriving, Ben Gvir said that the government would not succumb to Hamas threats, reiterating that the Temple Mount is the most important site for the people of Israel and saying we will maintain freedom of movement for Muslims and Christians, but also Jews will ascend the mount. He added that those who make threats will be dealt with an iron fist. The decision to visit the site was reportedly made during his meeting with Netanyahu on Monday. Ben Gvir insisted on a visit to the Temple Mount, saying that the government must not capitulate to Hamas terror threats of retaliation, and Netanyahu reportedly did not object to the visit, as was previously reported in Hebrew media. Ben Gvir initially announced his intention to visit the site on Sunday as he took on his new role as national security minister. Following the announcement, the Gaza-based terror organization Hamas threatened that Ben Gvir's pilgrimage would ignite the region and warned it would not stand idly by. The Palestinian Authority also condemned the visit in a statement calling it an unprecedented provocation. On Monday, opposition leader and former Prime Minister Yair Lapid also spoke out against Ben Gvir's intended visit, saying people will die. אסור שיתמר בן גביר יעלה להר הבית. זו התגרות שתוביל לאלימות שתסכן חיי אדם ותעלה בחיי אדם. עם כל זה שביבי חלש, הוא מוכרח הפעם לעמוד ולהגיד לו, אתה לא עולה להר הבית כי ימותו אנשים. Yet, despite the threats and warnings, Ben Gvir's visit to the Temple Mount occurred in full consultation and approval of Israeli security forces and without incident. Though now, Israel will likely be on high alert for retaliation by terror organizations following the visit.